princess. Ratata. Oh shoot, everyone. I'm. I apologize for that, but I should have known that this was gonna happen. <laughs> what butterfly is evolving? Congratulations, butterfly! Evolved into Metapod. <laughs> Metapod. Butterfly. Alert. Oh, great that move. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not gonna hear the end of it. Good day everyone, it's Peachy and welcome back to more Pokemon Crystal. As I unexpectedly happened a while back, um, I actually had Butterfly evolve into um, Metapod by total accident. I should have known. And funny thing is, Metapod is actually Pokedex number 11. I didn't realize that at the time, so it's a good thing I caught a number 11 Pokemon. But yeah, so... Anyways, back to what I was doing. I actually went back to the Pokemon Center to heal up, and that way we could take on the Bellsprout Tower. But unfortunately, I had a little mishap and evolved Caterpie, so my bad. And more drugs on the ground. Paralyze heal. Well, I guess that actually helps us in medical practice, so. Anyways, Bellsprout Tower apparently has us um, walking around battling trainers because we need an HM. We stand guard in this tower. Here, we express our gratitude to honor all Pokemon. Are you sure you're honoring all the Pokemon? Because all you seem to have is Bellsprout. Sage Chow. <laughs> okay. Bellsprout. See that neck movement? Ooh, talk about creepy. It's kind of like at the stage where most of the caterpillars are turning into that, really. Bellsprout, use Vine Whip. It's not very effective. So personally, it would be a good idea to have a bug Pokemon when you enter this place, but you know. Always go with your favorites, as I like to say. For Pokemon, I'll probably be choosing my favorites as well. Of course, it probably might not help, because a lot of the Pokemon I would use is on that, what do you call it? Uh... On Yu Yu, or I don't know. There's like this weird list of Pokemon where they're like, you can you can't have that Pokemon because it's O U, or you can't have that Pokemon because it's Yu Yu. You know, I had all. I was like, what the heck? What does that even mean? But yeah, they have like this list out for telling which Pokemon is which on their list. Uh, oh, I think what wasn't one of them called In You, or it's never used. And it's like, those are the baby Pokemon, like, um, Iglybuff and Cleffa. Cleffa's awesome, by the way. Awesome! <laughs> Bellsprout, use Vine Whip. Vine Whips. That's not a very good name for that attack, though, Vine Whip. <laughs> the Office Whore. Bellsprout. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. We should have named all our Pokemon after Mario Party is things. But there's oh well, Wiggler is actually um Butterfree, right? Oh, I know Sprout Tower. Not really that. This part is probably not too exciting, if you know what I mean. That's why I'm just like, oh, Bell Sprout Tower. I mean, even the episode four wasn't even the, <clears throat> wasn't even all that cool either. It was just like, yay, another day in Pokemon. Sometimes you feel like some of those episodes were just like, oh, just throw one in there. We don't want the season to run out too quick. Bellsprout Tower is one of them. Then you know, you have those like weird, that that group of kids. I always like how in the anime, they always make Ash do things that, that was against his will. And he wasn't even like kidnapped. He had to do it. Butterfly, how could you betray me like that? Maybe I should have bought some more potions when I was at the Pokemon Center. See, all you do is just button mash in this game. Yay! Level 8. Dang, it's attack is 9? Jeez. Sage Chow! Mr. Chow! Thank you. I don't know why he's thanking us, because we're the one getting the money from him. Better heal up. Bellsprout, you're costing me. Jeez. Okay, let's 
see. I think I'm supposed to go up, right? Ah! Uh, oh, I f yeah, I <laughs> see, I forgot again that there's wild Pokemon in here. Radita! I mean, Rata! We don't even know what its name is. Tail Whip! Butterfly's Defense Bell. Remember, um, Rata's second evolution? Um, Raticate! <laughs> it's always it's kind of funny, too, because, like I said, with the whole listing things of the way Pokemon work, then you get, like, Pokemon where they just designed to be too weak, because I don't recall ever seeing a Raticate on Wi-Fi battle, let alone seeing a Jigglypuff or Wigglytuff online. That's right. When in the Kalos region, my helper Pokemon is Wigglytuff. <laughs> Wigglytuff? What happened to Chansey and Blissey? Ah! Uh, I forgot about that item, and here um, I stepped onto a Pokemon trap again. We're just gonna battle all these Rattas and get rid of their rat problems. <laughs> Bellsprout's not only infested with humans, but rats too. Scared child, I may mean, afraid of no hulkly beast. And should one of those hairy barbarians come through that door, <gasps> threats! If any of you know where that's from, peachy points for you! Get rid of them! Tail whip. There's actually this one attack, um, I can't remember what it was, but I know it's in this game. It goes, um, do 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 do! Is it double team? I, maybe it was double team. It's kind of hilarious how it sounds. Peachy found an X accuracy. Cross accuracy or whatever it's called. No! I'm getting tired of the rats. Wonder if it'll let me leave or run away. Butterfly! Okay, good. We don't need no more unnecessary wild Pokemon. Ah! I guess humans are now sway like leaves in the wind. Okay, so you just walk around and you know, some guys like stop sway like leaves in the wind. Edmund wants the battle. Edmund goes to the bathroom. Whew! Excuse me, everyone. By the time we're done with this, we might as well just call this bell sprout to the wall. Well, at least it's not very effective. Oh man, excuse me everyone. Now I feel the sleepiness coming in. Mario Party! Love Mario Party. Hope you're all enjoying Mario Party 4, mainly because of the fact that I got 4,000 subscribers! Thank you so much, everyone! This is technically the fourth episode, so I thought I would mention it on this one. Even though it would have been a lot cooler if I did it on the first episode. It's not very effective. Somebody needs to tell Sage Edmund that Bellsprout doesn't work against Metapod. Vine Whip! In the anime, they make Vine Whip look so dangerous, but I guess in the games it's like harmless almost. I mean, I think it's probably the most weakest grass move almost, aside from like singing or whatever it's called. You know, like how um, in the anime, Jigglypuff is always singing her songs and everyone just like crashes out? You would think that would hold true to the, um, to, um, what do you call it? to the games too, but guess what? It only has like a 50% ratio of hitting, so more than likely your Pokemon, the opponent's is not gonna fall asleep. But oh, in the anime, every single Pokemon falls asleep, even humans. It's like, really? Why can't you make the games like the, I mean the anime just like the game? Or make the game just like the anime? 
But then again, it's understandable that everyone will probably just use seeing to make you go to sleep. We can't even tag the person's face either. Yay! Level 9. Uh oh. I just realized something. Isn't it? I've been using tackle this whole time and I think I'm almost out. Oh, I'm weak! Might have to go to the Pokemon Center. Let's see. Ooh, yeah, I can only use it five more times. That's not good. Um, Actually, I think I'm almost done with this place. Oh, actually, there's like three more. Maybe I'll battle one and head back. I train to find enlightenment, enlight, enlightenment in Pokemon. Okay. That was like useless information almost. Jin! <laughs> Who wants a bell sprout again? Whoa, level 6. I don't even think I can kill it in time. Or at least the speed fell. Growth. I don't even think that's gonna help it because Vine Whip's a physical attack, isn't it? Ooh, critical hit. It's not very effective though. Gotta kill it as much as I can. Ah, uh, he's dead! Damn it! Should have just healed it. Now I have to go back to the center. Thanks a lot, Bill Sprout. Uh, we'll do scratch. Oh, <laughs> yeah, did right off the bat. Good job. Actually, that would have come in very helpful for a Metapod. My training's incomplete. Ugh, useless Pokemon Center run. Uh, let's see how long is it gonna take me to get over there. I'll be right back. Okay, everyone. Okay everyone, I'm back. So it took about a good, like, what, minute to do that? Two minutes, I'll say. So let's get going. Let's go! <laughs> the Elder's HM even lights pitch black darkness. Wow, what a bunch of useless information again. Okay, what's up, sir? Neil! Actually, Neil's a pretty good character in Illusion of Gaia. Oh, I can hardly wait to play that game for you all. Yay, another level 6. Harden. Show you to mess with me. Uh, I guess maybe... Well, you know, actually I forgot that some moves back in the day were considered physical instead of, like, special. And then some special were actually considered physical, so... Vine Whip back in the day may have, may have been considered a special attack at the time, but we'll have to, I'll have to find out. <sighs> and I don't have like internet access to so just check it out right now, but I do know have a way to look it up. Goodness gracious, Bell Sprout's gonna kill me. <laughs> no, butterfly, butterfly, butterfly is gonna be dead. Too bad I didn't get like a what do you call it? Critical hit. Ah, of course, just give it to the opponents. Let them have all the critical hits. Might have to do a double back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, 13. That's not good. Hopefully, um, he kills it. Ah. I f oh shoot, I forgot to buy potions again. Neil. Thanks a lot, Neil. Now nah, I might have to go back to the... So, whatever, your head's full of bricks. It's a good thing, too. Oh, okay, I have enough. I assume. Maybe I should use one of the berries for Metapod. I do have like four of them, so it should be okay. Made Butterfly, Butterfly, oh my gosh. Made Butterfly hold the berry. 
Let me see how much you trust your Pokemon. Why does everyone need to see how much we cherish our Pokemon? Troy! <laughs> Another stage 6 Bell Sprout. 7 this time. Actually, I should have switched out Metapod for um, Total Dial when I think about it. Ha! Huh, that's weird. This one doesn't do that much damage compared to the other one. Okay, well maybe now it's doing more. It failed? What? No way. You wasted my attack, Bellsprout. There we go. Jeez, why did it fail? Shouldn't have done that. Rigged. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh, I'll say what? It missed? Better not have missed. Or so help me, gosh, I will throw this game out the door. <laughs> Maybe out the window might have been... Oh, now you missed. Jeez, seriously? Ugh. Watch, the next thing you know it's going to get a critical hit. Not very effective. Not very effective, but it's killing me. Well, there goes all my potions. <laughs> Dang, this whole Bellsprout Tower took the entire episode today, didn't it? Not even that interesting, like I said. Ah, just one little HP. They couldn't even give it to me. Or get rid of it for me, I should say. If I didn't miss, it would have been dead, actually. No, it didn't evolve? Are you kidding me? Hoo hoo. I remember that one. It was that one bird Pokemon that looked like it had one feet. Or one leg, but it's actually got two for as weird as that is. <laughs> I always thought that was kind of interesting that that happened. I think Ash is actually the one that caught a hoot hoot. Or no, 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 he didn't catch her a hoot hoot. It was a knocked owl, and it was funny because it was like a darker shade. I mean, a shiny shade. And I said, hey! I didn't think they would have shiny Pokemon. Oh, that was one thing too in this game. They introduced um, shiny Pokemon, so hopefully I at least catch one on here. Um, I don't even remember if I caught one on the original. I don't think I did though. I do remember seeing a, a shiny Snubble one time. I didn't capture it because at the time I was like, oh, what's wrong with it? It's got like a disease or something. <laughs> Sage Troy was defeated. Great, now I might have to make the long track back to buy it, to the Pokemon Center. Might have to, I don't know though. What was that noise? You are indeed skilled as a trainer. As promised, here's your HM. But let me say this, you should treat your Pokemon better. The way you battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools of war. Hey, bad hair day guy. <laughs> he claims to be the elder. He claims to be the... Uh, what was his voice? He claims to be the elder, but he's weak. Stands to reason. I'd never lose to fools who babble about being a nice to Pokemon. I only care about strong Pokemon that can win. I really couldn't care less about weak Pokemon. Martheo used an escape route. <laughs> Interesting. Well, I could use that, but I don't know if I want to. I don't even have anything on my uh, either. Let's see. Pokemon. Hmm. You know what? I'll chance it. It's gonna cost me, but you know.
No, I was gonna talk to you, and then here this wild thing comes out of nowhere. Rata. <laughs> Better make me run, thank goodness. Okay, so good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you, your Pokemon. You, your Pokemon. <laughs> so this one is, uh, what's his name? Sage Lee, or Lai. Bellsprout. More Bellsprouts, how nifty. Oh, come on, really? So I don't have that much HP and you're gonna do this to me? Dang. Oh, yeah. Ugh. This is why sometimes you don't like Pokemon, because it makes all the opponents get the critical hits and you're the one always missing. And always falling asleep, always getting poison. Even in the newer games, it does that. <laughs> I might get killed off. I shouldn't. That's not good if that happens. Ugh! Stop being faster than me! Get a critical hit, butterfly. Jeez. Ooh, I don't know. I should chance it. Of course they're faster. Okay, good. It's dead. Finally reached level 10. <laughs> yeah, I should have doubled back to the Pokemon Center and bought some potions. Bellsprout. Bellsprout. Cheater. That's all I'm gonna say. I don't know. I should use Leer right now, but might use um Vine Whip or Growth right away. Yeah, I did. Yikes. Rage on them. Go rage on them, sir! Oh no, I'm almost dead. My rage is building up! <laughs> now I'm getting all nervous because I feel like I'm going to get killed off right away. Ah, it would have been more awesome if um, it died. Hey! Why are they always getting the critical hits? I'm just trying to be a water type, you know? Oh, now I get a critical hit when it's like at 1 HP. Yep, I'm dead. Damn it! That stupid critical hit junk. Oh, now? Oh my gosh. That should have missed when Totodile was on. Oh well. I guess getting killed off should start off the day early, if you know what I mean. Let's see. What time is it? Oh, I have enough to go back there and beat his, you know, arse. Okay, everyone, I'll be right back. Ugh, okay, everyone, looks like I made a mistake because Metapod is supposed to evolve at level 10 into Butterfree, but unfortunately, because I died, he didn't evolve. So now the problem is, um, even if Butterfree evolves, it's not going to learn its um, level 10 attack and... Ugh. I'm like, shoot, if we had like starting over, but then I don't want to start over. But now the game's forcing me to start over. See, look at that. Oh my gosh, I hate this game. <laughs> oh my gosh. Watch it be all easier now, just because I got killed off. 
<laughs> oh, oh my gosh, critical hit. Only in the red zone. Freaking bell sprout! I don't ever want to see you ever again. And anyone who has a bell sprout should just burn it up. Bell sprout, you can find me. Ugh! Why are they always getting the critical hits? I thought growth just increases their special attack. Watch him just get another critical hit out of nowhere. Wow, increasing his special attack. Good, you're dead. Moo! Is that freaking ho hoo Killed me. That stupid growl. Why did it use that too? Oh my gosh. <sighs> stupid. And why didn't it use that either? Oh my gosh. Just getting, look now that guy's being like an idiot. Oh, well, I guess since you lost, I'll just start using random moves for no reason. Oh, there! He's up. They're all dead. <laughs> Sage Lee was defeated. Ah, excellent. Che excellent, my you know. Butterfly is evolving, but it won't learn that attack for you at two at level ten. Too bad. I think it's supposed to learn Gus, but I don't think it's going to. In Yeah, see? Can't even learn it. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this flash. Peachy receive HM05. Peachy put the HM5 in the TM pocket. Flash eliminates even the darkest of all places. But to use it out of battle, you need the badge from Violet's gym. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for nothing, dude. You just ruined my... my <laughs> he just ruined my experience. Alrighty everyone, so that's gonna do it for this um, recording's Pokemon Crystal. So she'll catch you next time for more Pokemon Crystal and we shall face off with the gym leader and um, probably should heal my Pokemon. Yeah, see he didn't even learn the attack. Dang it, stupid game. Anyways, bye! Really? I like how they remastered this theme as well. They could have used the Diamond and Pearl Gym theme, but they remastered it.